Hey, Shani from SpeedReview.com. I had seen this puzzle before on, I believe Red KB did a video of it, but I never actually seen it anywhere that I wanted to purchase. And then a friend showed me one, there was one at Target and I went there and they were out. So I just got it off Amazon. This, it looks like Mole Cube, but I'm pretty sure it's Mala Cube because Molecule, Mala Cube. And the way it works is like a Sudoku. Every side should have one of each nine colors. So let's look at this real quick. Precision craftsmanship, create a smooth spinning puzzle that glides like silk through your hands. Then there's the puzzling piece. Can you get nine unique colors on each side? Give it a spin. It's a six sided Sudoku with a bold infusion of color that will set your senses on fire. Okay, let's take a look. How do I open this box? There we go. Now I'm curious, this is really flexible, and I saw some reviews on, oh, it's clicky. That's kind of cool clicking mechanism. I saw some things online, yep, thing pieces can pop out pretty easily. And I'm, um, let's get that back in there. I'm wondering, can I pull the center off and tighten this? I don't think so, it's kind of glued on. So it's definitely can flex if you get someone who's really rough with it, things could pop. But let's give it a scramble. <laughs> let's just right away mix this up. And to solve it, I have not, you know, I haven't looked at any tutorials or anything. But let's just take a look at this. We've got each center is a different color. It looks like light blue, dark blue, orange, yellow, black, white. Oh, there's a little, is that a logo? Yeah, it's a Mefferts logo. So this is a Mefferts puzzle. So every center is a different color. There's no red center and no purple center or green. As far as corners, white, black, blue, green, dark blue, green, yellow, orange. So there is no purple or red corners and then edges. So I should write that down exactly which one's what because that's probably going to really help solve this. So let's just do this white one. Let's see here. Black, orange, blue, red, dark blue. So I need a purple and a green. Okay. Let's Move that green in, and then let's put this purple in. I like this ball bearing clicking mechanism. Okay, there we go, one side done. So then here, black, red, orange, blue. So here I wanna have a white, which I already have there. Let's say a green, a dark blue, a purple. Right, green, dark blue, purple. What's the other one I'm missing? Dark blue, purple. I don't know. Let's just put this in and find out. Although, yeah, I probably shouldn't do that layer. That, I don't know how to solve once I have two layers done like that. So let's just put in this purple one here. And then let's say green. Is there a green edge? There is no green edge. So we don't want that. Black is actually, no, we don't want black in there. We want, let's do white. And then, let's see here, white, dark blue, purple. We don't want purple, so let's do a yellow. Then yellow, orange, red. Okay, so now this top layer, oh, this is not gonna work. Top layer has all of those like that. What I could do is just look at this top layer and then figure out where I can move this black edge into. Well, this is interesting. So I need to add a purple in here, but then I also need light blue and white. I don't have that. Well, this is more difficult than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> but that is the Mala Cube. This is quite fun to use. Yeah, it, it does turn really nice and smooth. I like this clicking sound in here, but it can easily pop. So, and I don't know if you can tighten these tensions. It doesn't, I can't get this center cap off, so I don't think you can. So just being not as crazy speed solving with it. But that's it. So that's the Mala Cube. I'm gonna put in the description below 
where on Amazon I got it because like I said, I couldn't find it at the Target because they were sold out. I know I've talked to some people about getting it stocked up online, but I'll put that link for getting on Amazon. This is definitely something I would suggest to get because this is a lot of fun. There's probably multiple different possible solutions for it. And I'm sure if I wrote out things like it was a Sudoku, I could find a solution much faster than just messing with it right there. So thank you very much. Leave your thoughts and questions in the comment section below. Hit like, subscribe for more content like this in the future. And as always, stop by speedcubeview.com for more news and reviews.